in this video we will learn about half wave rectifier this is the circuit of half wave rectifier where the input ac voltage is given to a transformer and from the transformer it is applied to a junction diode and this rl is the load resistor let us now see how this half wave rectifier circuit functions now when the ac voltage is applied as we all know this is the ac voltage or a waveform which represents ac voltage as we see here this is a positive going cycle and this is the negative going cycle let us call this as positive half cycle and this as negative half cycle now let us see how the circuit behaves during positive half cycle now during positive half cycle let us consider that the two ends of the secondary of the transformer are at positive and negative potentials respectively that is if i call this end as a and this as b and a is at positive potential and this b terminal is at negative potential now if you observe the circuit connection the positive of the diode is applied is connected to positive of the input voltage and negative of the diode is connected to negative of the input voltage so therefore in this condition i can say that diode is in forward bias state so when the diode is in forward bias state we know that diode conducts and allows the current to pass through it so therefore there will be a current flow through the diode and a voltage is developed across the load resistance we will call this voltage as v not so therefore during the positive half cycle of the input voltage we see a voltage which is developed across the load resistor and this voltage has same shape as that of input voltage so therefore if this is the input voltage and during positive half cycle we get output voltage which has same shape as that of input voltage so this is how your output voltage waveform will be during positive half cycle now let us see what will happen during negative half cycle of input voltage that is during this part of the input voltage now when the negative half cycle of the input voltage is applied these two terminals a and b the potentials will get reversed that means now a will be at negative potential and b will be at positive potential so if you see the circuit connection this negative potential connected to positive of the diode positive potential connected to negative of the diode so therefore during negative half cycle the diode is in reverse bias and we know that when a diode is connected in reverse bias it does not allow the current to flow through it that is diode does not conduct that means there will be no flow of current through the diode and there will be no voltage across the load resistance so when i come to the waveform so during this negative half cycle of the input voltage 
I do not see any voltage across the load resistance. So therefore here the voltage is zero. There will be no voltage at all during the negative half cycle. Then next again there will be positive half cycle of the input voltage. Again diode will be forward biased and there will be a voltage across the load resistor. Then again during negative half cycle the diode is in reverse bias and there will be no voltage across load resistor. The voltage is zero. So therefore this is the output voltage waveform and this is the input voltage waveform. If we observe this output voltage waveform though it is not constant but it is unidirectional. There are variations but the waveform is unidirectional. Hence we can say that the output of half wave rectifier is pulsating. And it is not 100% DC.